Even though I posted my video of my Project Pan intro a week after I filmed, I still think I'm updating this a little bit earlier than when I initially made that video. I can't remember when I exactly filmed it, but I wanted to do an update now so that in the future I'm not just updating halfway through the month, but sometime in the beginning. So I also do have something exciting to share, so I thought I might as well do it now. So I'm just gonna get straight into the products. I just chose a handful of things I want to use up, and then once those get used up, I'm gonna roll something else in. There's no hard, fast rule of how many things I want in this project at one time. Generally around five seems to be a good number for me. But I'm just gonna start with the exciting one, get that over with. So I had the Ulta Gloss Stick in here. It was the shade Chill Pill. There wasn't a ton left. I can show you a picture of how much I had left very little it was slanted because the actual product was slanted and so it was a little hard for me to roll up even for that outline to be drawn but i just had this in my pocket in my apron at work so because it was such a little product left and because i can use it so often <laughs> without even thinking about you know options it's just this is the one thing in my pocket it was pretty easy to use up i was really surprised with how quickly i used it up ignore the noises there are two puppies playing with each other right next to me. But I remember being really surprised when I used this up. I thought it would roll up higher, but then it just stopped. It just stopped rolling up. And so I even took this part off, pushed it up with a tool, and it wouldn't go any higher. So I, because I convinced myself that it actually just, the mechanism broke and there was more product in there. But yeah, I'm not going to dig it out. I'm, I'm just not that kind of person. So yeah, finished it up. Pretty happy about that. Now that that lip product is done, I moved this into my pocket and my apron to use up next because it is the oldest tinted lip balm kind of product and I prefer those when I'm working because I like moisturizing kind of things. Um, this is the e.l.f. what is this? Hydrating Core Lip Shine in the shade Lovely. This center core is just clear balm but it doesn't move as quickly as the color so it's making it increasingly weird to apply. Um, so yeah, I also don't love the color. It's just really warm and bright pink for me, um, but I don't hate it. So I'm gonna finish it up, obviously. There's not a ton left. I think it'll take me within the next two months to use this up, maybe one month. I don't know. Um, That'd be nice, just cause I'm ready to move this out. But this is now my new focus. But what I, before this was my focus, I would apply this before I went to work because obviously I didn't have the lip product that was in my apron. So when I went there, I was wearing this and then I'd reapply with the other one. So now this is what I reapply with. And then this will be what's in my purse just for anything else. I'm wearing it today. It's really new. I don't know how I love this color. It's very light for me. It's a lot lighter than what I usually go for. So I chose to pan this one instead of the other color because I think I like it less, but I haven't had much time to try them. But it seems nice. What do you guys think of this color on me? Let me know. Let me know. Do you think it looks too light for my complexion? Because that's how I feel. But also, it's just something I never I never wear this kind of color. This one is completely full. I mean, I've maybe used it once. I will have to make a line for it. But this one will take a lot longer than the other ones I've been working on because it is brand new. The last item that is in a tube form is also from e.l.f. It is a no budge shadow stick in the shade Perfect Pearl. This is the most underwhelming product I've ever used in my life. Um, it honestly does nothing. So and if anything, it makes my area look worse if I try to apply it as an inner corner highlight. It just makes it a really weird texture. So I haven't been using it for that. You can see I've made a little bit of progress decent amount. I've only used it a handful of times, less than 10 for sure. I've used it in like this area of my face, try to, to try to be like a face, kind of glowy face, face, highlight, whatever. It really just does nothing. And if anything, again, it makes the texture of my skin look a little bit worse than if I would just use a concealer. So that's why I haven't used it a ton because I don't want to, but I just need to stick with it for like a month and use it every single day and then I'm pretty sure it'd be gone because I'd be using it on my face, use it a ton. At, if it's gonna do nothing, I might also do, have it do nothing and use it up faster. Now this next item is really not interesting to look at right now. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm seeing a tail wag in the screen, but it is a Franken contour bronzer kind of product that I made out of 
the dark shade and the light shade of a contour duo i mix them together so that the color is actually usable for me i'm wearing it today i don't feel that up a ton it's very subtle um i have a puppy trying to bury something in the bed um but yeah there's no discernible progress, no big dips. If anything, the dip is actually a ring and it's raised in the middle, probably because I swirled my brush in a circle. I'm just gonna try to use this up by the end of the year. I'm not rushing on that. The last item I have is a blush that I made from a blush and some eyeshadows mixed together. There's a tiny bit of visual progress. As you can see, there's a bit of pan here. I have a feeling it will look like nothing's happening until once I hit pan, it'll spread like wildfire. That's my guess. So I, this is the only blush I've really been wearing. <laughs> I'm wearing it today. It's kind of faded because I've been wearing it since um, like 7.30 in the morning or something like that. So yeah, it's a really pretty neutral subtle blush. I can wear every day and I'll think about it. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed and I hope that you have an amazing day. Bye.